Eihachi Mishima, billionaire megalomaniac behind the King of the Iron Fist. And Geese Howard, karate kingpin behind the King of Fighters. These two ruthless businessmen are as talented at martial arts as they are terrible at being dads. But whose fury will prove the most fatal? He's Wiz and I'm Boomstick. And it's our job to analyze their weapons, armor, and skills to find out who would win a death battle. Welcome to the final match of the international collaboration between the Iron Fist and King of Fighters tournaments. The prize, sole ownership of both the Mishima Zaibatsu and the Howard Convection. Oh, whoa, whoa. Uh, flagrant disregard of antitrust laws, but okay, let's go to our fighters. Heihachi Mishima! Hmm? And his opponent, the Howard! Uru Kana Yatsumi. Shinu Taku wa dekiru ka? Mishima. Your I will stand my hands, with your blood, old man. the soy sauce for geese because this goose was cooked both fighters had the brutal tenacity and martial arts mastery to push each other to the limit but heihachi just had the greater limits to push sorry wiz this one was obvious one of them throws people off cliffs the other has people throw him off cliffs kind of a no duh it was not a no duh in fact, Geese's wider variety of chi techniques were able to keep Heihachi at a distance, and his ability to draw chi from the earth meant he could spam them for as long as he wanted. But Heihachi has had plenty of experience with projectile spammers like Kazuya, whose lasers are fast enough to reach outer space in seconds. He'd have no trouble getting in close. Heihachi's decades of combat training over Geese also allowed him to learn and adapt to his Aikijutsu. He's even defeated Aikido masters like Nina Williams before, so it wasn't entirely new to him. Ultimately, it came down to who was stronger, faster, and tougher. Both scaled to characters like Jack and Takuma, who survived satellite lasers nearly equal to each other. But both feats were performed pretty casually by weaker characters. So what could they do at their best? For Geese, let's look at his fight with Burst, who created that hurricane. 
By measuring its size compared to the stadium to get the mass of the clouds, making a storm that big would take about 1.8 gigatons of TNT, about a thousand times more powerful than the Zero Cannon that could destroy Southtown. But we're not done. One single jack unit was able to destroy a six-mile-wide asteroid heading toward Earth. Estimating its volume and density, the energy it would take to violently fragment it is nearly 8 gigatons of TNT, over four times more powerful than Versus Hurricane. And Eihachi can tear through jacks like nothing! Which is crazy, because that satellite laser it reacted to was moving at about 4% the speed of light, twice as fast as the Zero Cannon and Geese's best. Geese was a clever, ruthless opponent, but Heihachi's power, experience, and sheer bullheaded stubbornness allowed him to walk away the victor. Man, this fight was so intense, it almost made Mishima pants. The winner is Heihachi Mishima.